go back and like look at the screwball comedies from the 30s and 40s, the, the trademark for those films was the banter, the repartee going back and forth, They're usually male and female. You look at Cary Grant and Catherine Hepburn just going at it, that's just terrific. That had to be part of this novel because for me that, that is a trademark uh, part of it. And I don't know, it, it sort of came naturally for me. I won't say that I didn't go back and massage the dialogue back and forth to get it exactly right. I certainly did that. But the initial drafts of it were pretty close to what the finished product was going to be. And I think I sort of inhabited the characters and that made it easier for me to sort of sense how people would talk. The information flow back then was not what it is today. You know, it's not like you could pull a smartphone out and just Google something, you couldn't. It was more direct and, and, and sort of privacy barriers. People weren't really uh, concerned about invading people's privacy because back then didn't have as much privacy, at least out in the real world. Today we have no privacy with social media platforms, but I'm talking about a different privacy. So for me the dialogue, you know, was, was I was kind of spot on with the dialogue right out of the gate, massaged it a little bit and got it better, but I was comfortable that I wrote in the first draft. Hachette.